Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, wherever you are in the world, as well as those who are neither. I am Ramblin' Rusty Elm, and you are watching Ramblin' with Rusty Starfield Edition. Last time on Ramblin' with Rusty Starfield, we finished off the uh, Empty Nest quest with Sam Co. Grabbed the artifact off of Aquila and took it back to the lodge. Then we also took on the uh, Freestar Ranger quest line, which we are pursuing at the moment. And after successfully rescuing a hostage, Cap Captain Hilt hostage, and destroying a Crimson Fleet ship, we are now on our way to take out a couple of uh, bad guy commanders on planetary surfaces. So, without further ado, and let's see, oh, make sure we're on the right. Let's see, we're going to go to RNA4C. Well, let's just see where that is. Oh, well, that's not too far. the answer to their question if I knew where the f they were going come on Bethesda you got to give us a little more to go on than that I just go and catch a break today Extreme environment. Of course it is. Look at all that copper and water. Let's see. We are going here. Let's get it on. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it's way over there. Okay, so what's over there? Just a structure. Looks like an abandoned mining facility. We may have to go check that out at some point. We will go ahead and get our sniping rifle out. Well, looks like they're uh, already fighting each other. Okay, so somebody just killed our guy. And don't come back. Messing with the fleet? Your funeral. You brought some extra layers, right? Otherwise, you'll make a fantastic icicle. This is true. Eh, not so much a fan of the scope, but You're the one hiding. 
hiding. I'm just standing Come here. Come out! Wherever you are! Hiding behind your buddy, are you? Probably upstairs, but we'll double check just to be sure. There you are. Down. Ah, there's one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This gun apparently needs a bigger mag. Is all you got? Uh, so one, two. Yeah, looks like uh, upstairs is next. Uh, all of them so now we'll do some looting so if you're wondering why I'm carrying this body along yeah he's got to come back to uh, the rock with me to face some justice well actually he already faces justice but oops Toss him up there. So how much of a thrill has it been traveling with the one and only last descendant of the great Solomon Co? Is it everything you imagined? Mm. Well. Thank you, Rose. Sarcasm, friend. <laughs> okay. So how is it traveling with one of the great Co's? How about it? Eh. I think you're doing your family proud. <laughs> well, that's a first. I gotta say, it's a relief being with you. So many people hear co and they expect me to pull some miracle out of a hat. Time has a way of just building on itself. Solomon was a good man. Great one, even. But if he ever heard all the bullshit being talked about him these days, <laughs> he'd flat out deck him. Yeah. I, I suppose, uh, I am. Uh, I suppose uh, I would be happy being a. Yeah, there, uh, hero there was a time, time well before Cora, where it really weighed on me. I felt like every little thing I did or didn't do was a reflection on our great legacy. It's enough to drive you crazy. Now I just hope I can help Cora to. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Um, yeah, it, every parent does want their children to learn from their mistakes. Your kind but words are appreciated. For my father, Cora, and me, everything starts and ends with Solomon Co. He looked out at the stars and he dreamed a way to get there. Imagine being the first person to jump into a new system set foot on a new world. Oh, I get it. That's powerful stuff. And now... <laughs> I'm just getting sappy. You're a bad influence, you know that? <laughs> Why, thank you. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm the worst. <laughs> yeah. That's what I like about you. Well, 
I hope the comic book they make about our adventures is better than that rag on Solomon. The yeah. stuff they publish is just downright embarrassing. <laughs> but that's what happens when uh, hero worshippers are publishing stuff about their heroes. Well, not every rock is swimming in nitrogen in O2. didn't fix it well it looks like Bethesda has somehow broken the ability to use controllers with this latest update so just one more issue with this game oh Sam why you gotta stand in front of me like that and, and there's one that always gets me. The path is clearly showing as heading off in that direction. But the target is over there. Where the... Well, if you weren't hiding behind a stupid generator or whatever that is, maybe you'd be able to see us. So tired of these guys freaking always running and hiding behind shit wall. And then talking about me hiding.
What the hell is shooting me in the ass? I saw there was a bad guy there. Do that on the way out. Huh? What was that? Looting the dead ain't glamorous, but it sure is profitable. This feels like old times.
guys want a target, I'll give you a target. Sam must have gone running in there like an idiot. This is my favorite part. Carry anything you need. Well, within reason. But I hope you're having a good right. day. Why are you all stink? All right, we are back at the ship. We have completed looting the place unloaded ourselves this time and we are now on our way back to Aquila City I believe we better check the mission board first though yep heading back to Aquila City so uh, let's see back up here to Cheyenne City. All class joints. Oh, you're back. I'm sure you did. And I'm glad to know that was your price. You did what I asked. Follow me. There's Sam, finally. Excuse me. Marshal. 
Am I? I take it you're here because you're satisfied that our new recruit can handle the job. Seems like a fine candidate got the right priorities. All right, then. Step forward, recruit. Let me have a word with you. Be safe out there. I've got just one question. Do you pledge to defend the people of the Free Star Collective, even if it means risking your own life? Why, yes, sir. I do. Absolutely. Good. Here, take these. You're now a Free Star Ranger deputy. I'm assigning you to Ranger Wilcox for some field training. Listen good to what she tells you. Welcome aboard, deputy. Congratulations. The Rangers ain't a bad outfit, and they're lucky to have you. Wish we could throw you a welcome party, but there's work to do. We got word from a farmer on Montero Luna. She says someone's trying to take her farm, and she's afraid she might be in danger. Well, what can well you tell me it's a moon me? that orbits Montero. It's got a breathable atmosphere, warm climate, and good soil for growing. Just the name, Michaela Wagner. There have been Wagoners on Montero Luna for a long time, and I'm sure they're proud of that heritage. Well, most things do at the start. Doesn't mean they stay that way. That being said, best not to assume anything. Just try to keep an open mind. Grab any supplies you might need, and let's get going. Pay attention to what Ranger Wilcox tells you. Yes, sir. call that an episode ladies gentlemen and those who are neither i'm rambling rusty elm have a good night and don't forget stop and smell the roses